hey everyone welcome back to my youtube channel this is yashika today i'm going to show you how to create a child incident button and how to copy parent incident fields to the child incident so let's open uh, incident list first so let me create uh, open a new incident okay so here uh, let me fill the short description email and just save it now you can see here we have three options three buttons you can say update resolve and delete I also want to create a child incident of this parent incident so how can I do that so I need to configure a UI action so just right click on the banner configure UI actions and uh, let's create a new UI action uh, just give the name of the UI action you want to create a button so I want to create a child incident button okay and the same name I want to give as the action name and make this UI action as a form button okay and just save it now if I open incident list again sorry let's start if i open incident dot list and open my recently created uh, incident then you can see here button has been created child incident okay so if i want to copy this short description this color this category impact same as in the child incident then we can do that we can do it okay so let's do it by scripting create a function let me create a function child button okay and uh, uh, make a new glide record for the incident table uh, glide record on incident table okay so gr dot initialize let's initialize the fields whatever we want let uh, say i want uh, first of all main thing we want to initialize parent incident parent incident is uh, like uh, we need it because it makes our current incident as a parent whenever we click on the child button then our current incident will become a parent incident so this is the most necessary thing you should remember parent incident uh, current dot society okay and uh, let's say category should be same current dot category okay and gr dot Okay, it's mistake current dot impact gr dot short description um, is equals to current dot short description okay you can do like uh, whatever fields you want you can copy as of now i am just copying these fields only and uh, gr dot insert let's insert them okay now uh, i want that whenever i click on the child incident then my form will redirect to the child incident form leave the parent form and redirect to the child form so we need to uh, write a query action dot redirect set sorry set redirect url and then need to write the url incident dot do sys id is equals to plus gr dot sys id okay sorry semicolon should come outside and just this is the function function is ended here so 
our scripting is over just save it and see it is working or not so this is our parent incident okay if i create a child incident is zero related records we have parent incident field here okay so here parent incident field is empty so we don't have any parent incident as of now if i create the child incident so yes it's been created child our short description is copied from the parent incident parent incident uh, number is uh, 43 and our child incident number is 44 and it has no child incident if i open the parent incident let's open it now you can see we have one child incident under it so in this way you can create a button according to your condition and you can work on that so hope you enjoyed the video like the video if you like the video then please like share and subscribe and thank you for watching have a great day